Last week was a difficult week for the campaign of Lacey Johnson, the Republican who was trying to unseat Congresswoman Ilhan Omar. A 17-year-old volunteer was shot and killed in North Minneapolis. A second volunteer was wounded. A suspect is in custody. Both police and the campaign said the shooting had absolutely nothing to do with the election. Now, according to federal records, Johnson has raised a stunning $4 million in his long-shot effort to beat Omar. Omar has been a recent guest on this program, but right now we are very pleased to welcome the Republican challenger, Lacey Johnson. Thank you so much, sir, for coming in. Thank you for having me. Um, I did want to talk, even though this horrible incident was not related to the campaign, we were talking before the show, and you feel it's definitely an evidence of something terrible that's been going on in your district for a long time, and that has really been heightened this past summer. Uh, yes, as may. When you have uh, leadership uh, that basically encourages burning down the third precinct station, uh, when you have leadership that's talking about uh, disarming, de defunding, demilitarizing the police, uh, when they don't talk to the members of the community, when you have uh, nonprofit organization bailing out people who have been involved in this violence, uh, when you don't have respect for the business people who worked all their lives to uh, build businesses and things, you make decisions, you say things which encourages this. I think if we had, in the beginning, sent the message that law and order is a priority, public safety is a priority, we would not be witnessing these things. And of course, I live in North Minneapolis where a lot of these things are going on. And I do know that uh, the members of our community, I find very few who support this. And I know a lot of them are pointing the finger uh, correctly where it should be pointed at uh, Minneapolis City, City Council, our leadership, and that includes Ilhan Omar who is saying things that's encouraging this. Uh, so uh, once again, uh, we see a direct connection between leadership and what's going on here, and we call for leadership to take the steps to bring this under control and correct it. Because at, in the final analysis, it's about people's lives and not about people about votes. And so once again, if we look at it that way, we'll take the proper steps. All right, we want to pull up the president's uh, recent tweet endorsing you uh, at several rallies in Minnesota. He has also endorsed you. Minnesota, we need Lacey Johnson in Washington, has my complete and total endorsement. That's in capitals. Um, <laughs> let me ask you, does the president's endorsement hurt or help you more in the 5th Congressional District? Well, if you come at it from a standpoint, if you understand my background as computer engineer and it's the corporate world, uh, it's building businesses, it's bringing consensus, you understand that uh, I've worked with everyone, no matter what your philosophy, no matter what your political party is, to get things done. So that's the first thing. The second thing is that if you understand politics, once again, going back to the computer analogies, uh, once you understand computers, they all work the same. It doesn't matter what label you put on them, it doesn't matter what color they are, it doesn't matter whether they're big or small. And that's the way I look at politics also. So where I'm going to is that any time any president uh, support you and what you're trying to do and how you're trying to help your community and you're genuinely trying to help your community. It's a good thing. Okay. You do have a handicap in this race because that district is a plus 26 Democrats, which means there's a 26 percent start for Democrats. Um, you, you and I talked about what you feel is, is the false stereotype of African American having this monolithic support for Democrats. Tell me about that. Tell us about that. Well, yeah, because uh, Really, they're about their lives and seeing problems solved. And I think one thing they do know, that 40 uh, years of Democratic rule has not helped our community and, and voting strictly Democrats. So this is an easy message to get to them and get them to look at changing and looking at the different ways of doing this. In fact, I had the same conversation with some people uh, yesterday who's, who have changed to Republicans. So I think but it's But how all, about the president, though? Because uh -huh. it, that, that probably would have been a better question, just the president, not just Republicans. I mean, does he have, in your view, a lot of support amongst people of color. Oh, in yes. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. And uh, you'd be surprised, especially among the younger people and especially along, among people who get to know what his policies are. Now, if you listen to the regular mainstream media and the 24 hours a day, 100% negative coverage, you have an issue. But once again, we pointed out after the Republican National uh, Committee convention, uh, his uh, ratings went up 9%. 
And that's because they saw the record. It was unfiltered. It saw it directly. And so whenever people really look at policy and, and results and things like that, and we can get that through the people, his support goes up. Now, it's, it's still a, a, a challenge. Uh, it's still climbing Mount Everest. And I try to explain to people, look, and that's just me, I don't go to politicians looking for love and respect. I go to politicians looking for results. I lo lo go to politicians looking to make a positive difference in the lives of our community and the lives of our families and things like that. And once you start getting people to look at it like that, what do I get in return for my vote? More and more people look uh, uh, are supporting a Republican or their same party, it doesn't matter. Okay. Well, Mr. Johnson, thank you so much for coming in. We appreciate you. your being here. And we did recently have a Congresswoman Ilhan Omar on this show. So thank you, sir, for thank coming you. in.